Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon. I hope you're all well today. So this is a poem that I wrote a while ago, and it's called Who Wrote the Score? I've got my little kid's piano that I'm just going to have a little bit of a muck around on here while I'm while I'm reading it. So we'll see in the art of improvisation. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> so this is called Who Wrote the Score? Do I dance and play with colour? Do I dance and sing it into form? Do I dance for myself or do I dance for the universe? That's a bit harder on the hands than I thought this. Does the weaver dance take my soul and guide me down my day? Do I match its step and do my part or does it all crash to a halt? Fluidity is the challenge. Preempt prevents the stumble. The beat knows where to go. The mind will try to prevent it. The conductor precedes me, orchestrating the path. Will I dodge the chaos, lose my rhythm and sink? The conductor sees the chaos. The steps seem random, yet precise. And why would I argue when I wrote the score? <laughs> there we go. So that's just a little poem. So here we go. And this is part two. In dreams I learnt my part, the frequency of the day, appointments to be met in some random unseen way. Synchronicity guides me, keeps the melody in tune, brings in other players to dance a step or two. The music of the spheres beats within my blood, nature's symphony as it dances with the universe it forms. Rainbow Serpent translates the tempo and sometimes loses it. <laughs> Fine tunes and directs the breath. I meet it in the moment. Around me dances the rest. Together or solitary, the dance always goes on. Dances upon dances as webs on webs collide. Paths intersect and the dance changes. Syncopated and awkward, then fluid and refined. Do you see your partner? Do they think they dance alone? There we go. So that was a little bit of fun. <laughs> there is my little kid's toy piano, which is what it's all about today. Please like, comment and subscribe.